Welcome to Boxy Outdoors. We're here for our second check, March 29th, it's Sunday, and uh, we had torrential downpours uh, last night, so everything is flooded out. I'm not sure what to expect uh, down here on these sets, but uh, we're going to keep on checking them until uh, Monday and we'll pull these sets. Um, as you see, we got some blue skies, so uh, all right guys, follow along. Hey guys, I wanted to show you this. This creek coming out here, and then that little dam that used to be right there is all washed out up against that log. If I didn't uh, erase footage that I have of this, I'll show you what it looked like just two days earlier. It's all blown out right now. I'm gonna apologize for the wind, guys. Uh, Right here's my first set. If you want to talk about blown out, this is blown out. So uh, I'm gonna have to get down in here and see if I can't find my trap. I am gonna leave it set for tomorrow. Uh, hopefully this recedes. But first thing I gotta do is check to make sure I can find my chain and uh, see if it's still set. If it's still set, I'll probably leave it set till tomorrow.
All right, guys. Uh, I'm gonna have to come back in here next couple of days. This is all flooded out, as you've seen. And uh, so I made out of my uh, from my steer carrier. I made this little drag here, and I was dragging across trying to find my uh, my drowner, my my uh, my wire, and uh, I can't find it. So one of two things. Somebody come along between last night or yesterday morning and uh, before it rained and I have a stolen trap. Uh, starting to get ready. You can hear the wind getting ready to storm on me again. I got to get down and check this other uh, trap and uh, get out of here. All right, here's uh, my last set. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to go down there and I'm going to try and drag it, try to find my, uh, my drowner. I'm probably going to pull this if I can find it. So you see how easy that was for me. All I did is I put that in there, drug it across, found my cable, pulled it out. Now, that first one, I think I got a stolen trap, guys. And uh, nothing makes you more sick. I am gonna go back and play around for a little bit longer. Just hoping I'm just going over the top of it, but I'm dragging down into the mud. All right, guys. I'll let you know if I find that trap. All right, guys. Uh, so I ended up pulling my last set. Uh, a little bit disgusted. I do believe I have a stolen trap. You know, of all these times, you know, I'm just out trying to do my thing. And uh, my mind's in a bad place right now. Uh, someone's stolen my trap. I will come back uh, for check day three just to check to see if this is receded, if I can find that trap. And I'll keep coming back until it, the water's been down and I can definitely know that a trap was taken and uh, that there's no beaver in that trap laying down there. Um, I guess he could have pulled out my stake, but uh, my stakes are a little over two foot long, so I can't believe that he would have pulled that out of the ground. So. All right, guys, it sucks. But it is a uh, public land. It's something that has only happened to me twice in the five years I've been trapping. So. All right. I hope everybody enjoys the rest of this video. Carry on. Of course, guys, I was not planning on uh, pulling, so I didn't bring my bucket to put all this stuff in. So, as you see on my uh, deer carry, I've uh, I had a friend buddy at work. He made me this T handle. I extended that. It's a heck of a lot easier with that. Uh, I tell you, if anybody has a game cart similar to this one here, uh, make yourself a T handle and uh, extend it out with a T bar. What's nice too is that's a round bar. 
fits so much easier on your hand. But as you see, I just put the rotor on the one side, put the uh, trap on the other side, wrap my cable around, and I'm going to be able to walk out. Check this out guys, uh, I just set this down here and uh, of course I'm using my uh, GoPro here. That freaking snake scared the piss out of me. Hey guys, uh, I'm here shooting some B-roll. Look what I come across. Uh, set my cart down and uh, set my video camera up. That's a fat sucker. Oh. Scared the piss out of me. Put my hand down by my handle and there it was. It wasn't there, I just walked through here. That son of a gun's out here, uh, I guess sunning himself. Uh, if I seen that around my house, it would be dead. Now nah, we're out here in the, the wild, we're gonna let this sucker have his peace and let him soak up the sun and enjoy his day. Man, that's nothing like getting yourself jump out of your skin. Whew. Beautiful looking snake though. I know what kind of snake it is. It's one that uh, I'm going to walk away from. There he goes. I'm assuming it's just a water snake. Check that thing out. All right, guys thank you for uh, watching this video um, even with the, uh, the possible loss and cost of that trap uh, I did enjoy this day um, all but that snake boy I tell you what it got the old ticker going so uh, please like subscribe if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet and uh, please guys leave me a comment and uh, as always I wish you all a blessed day